are, another year is coming to an end. As we approach 2017, New Year's are a time for resolutions. Some are kept, some aren't. But today our staff is going to share with you a resolution we all made when we took this job, became part of this profession. The Law Enforcement Code of Ethics. As 2017 approaches, we reaffirm our commitment to it and to you, the community we serve. Thank you. As a law enforcement officer, my fundamental duty is to serve mankind, to safeguard lives and property. To protect the innocent against deception, the weak against oppression or intimidation, and the peaceful against violence or disorder. And to respect the constitutional right to all, to liberty, equality, and justice. I will keep my private life unsullied as an example to all. Maintain courageous, calm in the face of danger, scorn, and ridicule. Develop self-restraint and be constantly mindful of the welfare of others. Honest in thought and deed in both my personal and official life, I will be exemplary in obeying the laws of the land and the regulations of my department. Whatever I see or hear of a confidential nature or that is confided to me in my official capacity will be kept ever secret. Unless revelation is necessary, in the performance of my duty. I will never act officiously or permit personal feelings, prejudices, animosities, or friendships to influence my decisions. With no compromise for crime and with relentless prosecution of criminals. I will enforce the law courteously and appropriately without fear or favor, malice, or ill will. Never employing unnecessary force or violence and never accepting gratuities. I recognize the badge of my office as a symbol of public faith. And I accept it as a public trust to be held so long as I am true to the ethics of the police service. I will constantly strive to achieve these objectives and ideals, dedicating myself before God to my chosen profession, law enforcement. The Law Enforcement Code of Ethics is not only our commitment to our profession, it is a contract with the community we serve, and it is our privilege to serve this community.